Hey everybody, it's the end of preliminary night two here in Miss America. We were live from Mohegan Sun at the Expo Center and I'm here with our preliminary night talent winner. This is Camille Shire. She is Miss Virginia and Camille has an interesting story about how she came to the Miss America stage. So talk to us about your journey from point A to point B and why you chose to compete. Yes, yeah, so it's to make a very long story short, I was there when you were crowned Mallory Love and it. I never thought that I could compete at the Miss America organization for two reasons. I didn't want to get in a swimsuit on stage and I didn't have a performing talent. So I kind of wrote it off and this year I saw a advertisement for a local competition the first week of April and I entered on a whim. It was the last one in my state of the year and I was like, you know, I have nothing to lose, right? Only mm -hmm. things to gain. I won that local competition with a science demonstration. First time I had done that and went on to my state competition, won the talent competition at my state, won Miss Virginia and now I'm here. And it's such a testament to how this organization can really change a woman's life very quickly. It's happened for me in eight months. I've been able to be on national television talking about science, women in science, changing the way this organization looks to the public. And I am so proud to be able to do that and to be a woman who is doing something really out of the box and different. I think traditionally in Miss America, we have women that are so talented in vocals, in, in being an instrumentalist, dancers, baton twirlers, women that have these talents that are incredible. Traditional, traditional stage And talent. so incredible. I mean, I wish I could do those things, <laughs> but in reality, I can't. And I think the most important thing for women today, and really all people, is to be authentic to who you are. And I think that that is what I'm able to express to the judges when I do my talent. I'm a woman who has a background in science. I love being able to teach it. I do it in schools. I visit 72 elementary schools this year and have done more in middle and high in Virginia. And I've been able to show kids that science is fun. And when they go to class and they learn about pH and then they remember Miss Virginia coming in and blowing bubbles in a titration and changing colors of solutions, they can connect how it's fun, but it's also relevant to what they're doing. And so I'm able to show that on stage in 90 seconds, which is really fun. It was probably the most fun I've had this week so far. <laughs> and I'm the first woman to win a preliminary talent award with a science demonstration and how cool is that? It's super cool <laughs> especially because talent is worth 50% of is. your score. It's a $2,000 scholarship tonight but you've also earned scholarship through Absolutely. Miss Virginia so if you were to win Miss America and you were to win that $50,000 scholarship what would that look like for you? I am currently one year into a doctor of pharmacy program at Virginia Commonwealth University. I have three years remaining and many scholar, many, many bills going toward that in the next three years. I've won about $21,000 of scholarship money through Miss Virginia, now more like 23, mm -hmm. adding on my $2,000 scholarship for the preliminary talent. And so as I continue through my educational journey, this will go directly toward allowing me to get a, a PharmD after this. and really spearhead my career going forth. And so I'm grateful for the organization for that. Wonderful. Well, if you guys want to catch Miss Virginia's talent, you'll have to tune in and see if she makes the finals. They'll be live on NBC this Thursday night at 8 p.m. Eastern, or you can watch it at NBC.com. And of course, they can follow your journey on the way there to Thursday at Miss America VA, or you can follow Miss America at Miss America, or you can see what we're all about at MissAmerica.org.